What are the buttons for? Zone no, this, this one. one. Marion Fire. This won't be loud. This part won't. Did you look here? Here. Yeah. See how we got the lights all lit up? That's what that did. Okay. Now, here. You on there? Yeah. Turn that off. Okay, here. Cover your ears. Are your ears covered? We're ready. Loud. <laughs> <laughs> Turn the siren on, but it will blow us out of here. <laughs> Ooh, I see some stairs right there. That's right. Okay, you see what these here are? You know what these are? These are our air packs. Okay, so if, if, if we go into a house that is filled with smoke, what do we tell you to do if, if there's a house full of smoke? What are you supposed to do? Supposed to get out and stay out, right? Yeah. Okay. If your house ever catches on fire and you hear your smoke detector go off, you're supposed to get out, right? Get out and say, well, this is why we're able to go in because we got the gear, we got air here <coughs> that we can breathe. This is clean air, okay, inside this bottle. So what we'll do is we'll put our face piece on. Well, I've got one on my gear rack. I thought we had a spare in here. Here, I'll tell you what. I'll pull this off here in a second and I'll show you, okay? Okay. I'm going to stay in here and just, just watch you, though, okay? This is a big step. How about I help you with that step? Okay. Yeah. There you go. But what's in there? Is there something in there? Oh, yeah. In this is like a giant toolbox. Let me set this out of the way so it doesn't fall on you. This is like a big toolbox. Okay. Now, what do we what do we spray on the fire to put it out, you think? Water. Water. Okay. So do you know what this part here is? What? You know those fire hydrants? Yeah. We were talking about? That's where we hook the fire hydrant to with, and with a big yellow hose. Other one well, of those other things. this is how we get water out of the hose. So, like, if I was wanting to get water out of this hose here, see how that says Speedway One? And it's see how orange. it's properly marked with words. That's right. And it's orange. We try to make this kind of. Oh, and it's color coded. Idiot proof a little bit. So that one there matches. Well, stress proof instead of <laughs> yeah. trauma proof or so, <laughs> something so nicer. So we're trying to get water out of that hose. We'd pull on that lever and water would come out. Oh my gosh, I love the colors. I never <laughs> knew that. Yep. Was that the Those are just kind of spare it's hoses water. we have. And then, and then we got a small little ladder here. And these are ice rescue suits we can put those on we can go into ice ice water okay because if somebody's stuck in ice water who's going to get them out who's going to get out somebody who's stuck in ice water creighton who gets them out i don't know firemen do and what are those what? okay look if if we had to jack something up like say we had to jack a car up to get it um, up in the air a little bit, we would take these pieces of wood and we would put those under the car as we're jacking. That way if something goes wrong, the wood will hold it. Does that make sense? Yeah. Have you ever and seen what does that other wood do? That's the same thing. That's the same thing. And then we have a couple of different saws here. Have you ever seen anything like this before? You know what those are? Before. Well those are called fire extinguishers. Okay, so we have three different kinds of fire extinguishers there. Yeah. <laughs> Are you looking for that pack? Okay. I brought it over here. I brought it over here. <laughs> he likes to know where everything That's is right. at all times. Okay. What's on the back? We got another hose. All right. Is that a big one? Uh, this is a, one of our little tiny hoses. Okay, if, if we were to pull it to like, like a little trash fire or something, that's probably what we would pull off. 
rather than a really big, heavy hose. Okay? Okay. <laughs> oh, here. And if you look in here, what do you think that is? A ladder. That's a ladder. Okay. Uh, somebody just came back. Here or here? Dad. Okay, this is a a battery powered light. And then like this is just shoved in there. Here, look here. This is a ram, and then we've got Hi. these here. This is Creighton, and this is another fireman. What's your name? Scott. Hi, Scott. Oh my gosh. That looks like a little lobster claw. Yeah. These are like a big pair of scissors, but rather than cutting paper, oh boy. We'll, we'll cut through steel. Okay. Isn't that neat? Yeah. And then we got another tool back there called spreaders and then they just spread apart. Can I see? Uh, right. Yeah, I can get that out for you. Let me thank you for your service again. Oh my goodness. Shh. Look there. Oh, I'm not gonna get you. I'm not gonna get you. You late. Oh, I'm, I'm good. My wife's coming to pick me up. So okay. As long as she's not here. <laughs> <laughs> You'll know when she's yeah. there looking at you. Come on. You're a good hand for Scotty. Oh. <laughs> Wasn't that funny? All right. We'll show you that one. You already seen the other side. Yeah. I'm going to go ahead and button that side Thank up. Thank you much. very, very much. much. Thank you very, very much. This is our saw cabinet. Keep all our gas card equipment in here. We got a fan, another fan. This is a K12 saw. This cuts metal, steel. And what is this, Creighton? What do you think yeah. that is? You see that? What is that circle? I don't know. That's the that's the blade that cuts. We we can put a new one on in case this one has it gets dull. Because in an emergency, you don't want to have to go to go to Menards really fast and buy another one. Nope. <laughs> it's not a good time to need another one. <laughs> Those blades are about 100 bucks a piece. These? That's gas. we got to use gas to fill these up to make them run. And what does those spaces do? Well, this is hazmat stuff. This is in case we have a gas tank leaking or a diesel tank leaking on a semi we can mix this up with water and it makes like a putty like silly putty like play-doh and then we can seal the leak but at my house i don't play-doh you got, got play-doh play huh yeah. it was in the other one. Well, same thing what is that That's what's on. That's what's inside of it. It's nothing but air. Air that we're breathing right now. Because sometimes, if you've been inside a house that um, has smoke in it, you need a little regular air because yeah. you can't breathe smoke. Right. Smoke is no good to breathe. It was in the other fire truck. 
This is our ladder truck. You know why it's called a ladder truck? Yeah. You see that big white thing on top of it? That is a ladder. Yeah. We use that to climb the high, high buildings in town. Can I see what's in there? Oh, there's not much in that truck. Can Just a bunch of rope. Can I see what's in there? In there? Oh, that's the batteries for the truck. Can I see the batteries? <laughs> yeah, I guess. Do you want to see them? Mr. Scott, how long did you have to go to school to learn all these things? Uh, well, I was a volunteer for five years before, and then that's why I got a lot of training listen. doing that. Let's listen. Do you hear what he's saying? How did he learn how to do this, Creighton? And then I went to school for about two years doing to learn all the all the aspects of my job. One lift. So when I'm running the truck, I stand up here. Look, and look, Creighton, what's play this? Play with all the levers. <gasps> what is this right there? <gasps> Just a little extra. What do you say, man? Thanks. Uh... Mm -hmm. <laughs>